and simulates that and I'm back with some more CK2, a quantum leap and we're back as the Byzantine Emperor. And we're currently just crushing this revolt quite successfully. Um, yes, so we've just had an outbreak of smallpox, which as you might imagine is not ideal. We should build a sick house, although that might take a little while. It's unfortunate that we've got smallpox. Theodosius, your court physician, informs you that Dionysius Tamerat is suffering from the current epidemic, having him stay with the rest of you inside. Oof. Oof. That is a tricky one. I mean, he will. It kills half of those infected, and he does pose a risk. Like, I'm sorry, bro. I really like you. I'm sorry, but I can't have you in here. You're also a lunatic. You're a syphilitic lunatic. I suppose that syphilis does cause lunacy in its, well, it literally does. It affects the way the brain functions. So that is, you know, a reasonable thing to be. But, you know, you can't stay. You don't have to go home, but you can't stay here which I did get told last night. Um, yep, you've been forced to seclude yourself. Yeah, I understand. Believe me, no one understands more than me. I'm going to take this false capital, march on him in Moesia and kill him. That seems like a reasonable plan for right now. And obviously the rate at which I'm grounding down the will of the defenders is much higher. Um, oh, I don't have any commanders. Why don't I have any commanders? Wow, that is a deficiency of commanders. Yeah, please, just as many moderately competent commanders as we could possibly have. Preferably above 10. Above 10 is where I like to be. 10 or above. No, okay. And then Krilios. Okay, we've taken part of this land, which means he'll be making less money. It means if he does have um, oh, of the Byzantine revolt. Oh, I appear to have captured a child. I mean, could always castrate him. Although I gains the trait cruel. Which I'm not cruel as a character, I don't think. I don't think the character I'm playing is cruel. He might be. Um... See, um, abdicate in favor of who? Captain Guthmund the Frail of the Varangian Guard, who has cancer. What the hell's wrong with you fools? And how does how come he's the one who gets the never mind? I will not be blackmailed because that will fuck me in the mouth if I accept the terms those terms. Okay, let's assess the landscape here. Um, they are quite fragmented. Which means I feel reasonably confident that I'm going to win. But we have to get them while they're fragmented. I doubt they'll really be able to unify. Oh, I have a, another grandson, Nick, Nikephoros, the genius. Of course he's a genius. Alright, to Ephesus, no, Epiros, Epiros, Epiria, basically. Uh, I've, uh, I've inherited Anatolia, as always. Wait, what did I just inherit? Oh, that's unfortunate. Halakarnosos. There's actually a very nice nightclub in, um, in Turkey called Halakarnassos. Um, which I, just, uh, I was in the general area of such a place. Um, not last night. Last night's adventure was in a much more mundane setting. Hmm. I feel like the strength of the rebels was a bit overstated. Right, so in the meantime, we need to hire two commanders. 
people who don't hate me ideally. It's Dionysius cured of well, he survived smallpox. He is a lucky, lucky person in this time period. He is an incredibly fortunate man. Uh, Duchy of Colonia. Probably shouldn't hold on to this. Uh, what the fuck is ah? I've inherited that. Okay, so we have resolved one issue. I should probably just give him the vice reality. Wait, do I hold the Duchy of Mesopotamia for some reason? Okay, you get that. Uh, you are the only not child, so I guess you get that. Enjoy. Enjoy your newfound riches and glory. All right, murder this person. I, it's just, it's just a bit of a mess right now. Oh no, my daughter of illness. I mean, she has to go. Sorry, dear. You have to go. You're also my rival, so you know, get the fuck out of my land, I guess. It's, it's the very impolite way of saying what I'm... Oh, oh, I'm... Okay, resolve that. So it looks a lot more manageable now. Now that we're not dealing with... Well... A shit ton of people. Oof. Oof, that attrition though. It ain't nothing to be messed with. Alright. This is, this is for all the marbles, really. Feel like we may have won. Yeah, I feel like this this is more or less swung in our favour at this point. Right, marching on tribes on tribes on whatever. Let's get out of the blight inflicted lands as quickly as possible, because then we're gonna Yeah. So as I could always just attack well, he's not really important. Kaikas Kocharid. What are you trying to do? Oh, you're just raiding my land. That's fine, it's not my land. It's my vassal's land. So we successfully seem to have defended our crown. Uh, in the meantime, you... Uh, since he's a traitor, it won't bother my vassals. Yes. That's fine, you can be um, discontent. I really don't care. Alright, so we continue. So we're going to march on Trabzon. Or are we going to sneak? Are we going to be able to get them? Yes. It's always good. We're going to be able to get them. And we should route him quite comfortably. Oh, my wife's pregnant. Well, isn't that nice? Basilisa Irina. Oh, they had a daughter called Plusheria. Always good. Oh, wow, she is not doing great. I am fairly sure she has cancer. Yeah. Oh, she has she has smallpox. So the, uh, basically the WebMD of the medieval era. So you have cancer. Oh, wow, she has the flu and smallpox. Yeah, this, this ship is sailing. Uh, personally praise him, of course. My heir. My gloriously competent air defensive pact has been disbanded. Wait, does that mean I'm no longer I'm no longer threatening? Right, we need to wrap this up ASAFP. DF stands for feasibly, by the way, for those wondering. But we need to wrap this up. I wonder if I just offer a oh hello. Oh, I've got a cough. Okay, this may be it. Offer white peace. Yeah. I get to imprison the person otherwise. Now I'll offer a white piece. Let's get this done. Uh, 
is not due to a serious illness. All right. Gave me hot goat's milk with honey for my cough. Well, yeah, that typically do it. If you uh from this region of the world, that does tend to be the way that it plays out. Um... Well, I'm not overly concerned about him. But yeah, we, we, we will be all right. But I am, I am imprisoning him and I'm going to revoke his title and then I'm going to make this person the ruler of that title, I believe. She is de jure in that ti title. Oh, he's also a count oh but he rules like a ton of shit so putting him under him is a bad idea right this is basically just curb stomping with me i don't know it may not necessarily be the most intriguing or compelling gameplay but it's uh i've inherited oh mesopotamia again oh you're not a child and you are a child so just by that basis alone here you go. Enjoy it. I'll hold um, the Duchy of Thrace for myself. Much rather have it for myself. Mm. Unlanded sons. I could always give him land, but. Oh, hold on. Oh, no. I really like Duchess Eladora. She was very good. Uh, do you right? Well, you're married to one of my relatives, so guess you get to be the Duke of well, the uh, ruler of Apurias. It's always nice, right? All right, let's just pick the best soldiers for each one. I need more commanders. Just always, always a need with me. I just need these commanders. Right. Come in. Everyone at court loves your dogs, especially the children find much joy in playing with him. That's always nice. Nice dog. Oh, I feel better. That's always good. You should feel better, man. I'm going to make her the viceroy of this territory if we come to that. Uh, daughter was born in the purple to Basilius. Uh, that doesn't make well. It's an elective thing, so I guess it wouldn't make her my heir. But she was born in the purple, named Nicoletta. I believe that would probably get her prestige. <coughs> Excuse me. Oof. That that was coming for a while. Uh, my court physician, Prince Theodosius, is worried about my newborn daughter, Nicoletta, as a feeble little thing, even for better other infants. No, you should you should try and treat my kid, because I, I want my kid to live. The price of decadence, the ruling dynasty of the Ulchilids, have been overthrown by the zealous and hard-working tribesmen of the Ally dynasty. Former vassals may seize this opportunity to declare independence. Hey, I mean, Ally. Nicely done. All right, so now we just got a. Hey, she's fine. She'll be fine. Uh, should we still be under lock? My instinct is no. Let's open the gate. Fantastic. We've opened the gate. We're good. It's going to be a shame when we uh, have to leap away, because, um, no, this is a very small gift, but thank you. I, I make so much money just from being the emperor. I don't think he needs to necessarily give me anything. Uh, sell my horse. What, you think we're not going to chase after a mystical stag? You, if you think that, you don't know me at all. We're going to chase after that stag. It's going to be great. Move everyone into Smyrna. 
I'm just going to hold all of this land hostage, essentially. This time it will not escape me. I've got a feeling it pretty much will. Just call it a hunch. Duchy of Crete. Well, this one is a relatively easy decision, seeing as there's only one man here. Yep. Nicely done. And I need a new advisor. Opinion. Always pick the guy with the highest opinion for an advisor. Because I don't think the advisor actually does anything. He just kind of is a voting stooge. Although he didn't come out as a loyalist immediately. So that's concerning. Uh, Mayor Inokentios. Sends words that several members of the Varangian Guard run amok among his quarter in, of Constantinople yesterday in their drunken stupor. The Norsemen fired, set fire to an inn, killed three guards, and physically abused five local merchants and two priests. The people are crying out for justice. Um... Ah, come on, boys will be boys. Oh, no, okay, I guess we have to. Well, yeah, boys will be boys. I like the Varangians, to be honest. Um, it is my own failure, and with that acknowledgement of my own failure, we're gonna leave it here. I've been simply as that. This has been CK2 Quantum Leap. Please like and subscribe, and I will see you next time.